हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई सोनू अग्रवाल असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर ऑफ फिजिक्स इन बियानी ग्रुप ऑफ कॉलेजेस वेलकम यू ऑल ऑन द बिहाफ ऑफ गुरु के पी यू टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू डिलीवर अ लेक्चर ऑन मैक्सिमम पावर ट्रांसफर थेरम इन ए सी सर्किट्स अकॉर्डिंग टू दिस थेरम मैक्सिमम पावर ट्रांसफर फ्रॉम सोर्स टू लोड वेन द लोड इम्पिडेंस इज द कॉम्प्लेक्स कॉन्जुकेट ऑफ द टोटल इम्पिडेंस ऑफ द सर्किट टू प्रूव इट लेट वी कंसिडर अ सर्किट विच है impedances and power source here zs is representing the source impedance zl is representing the load impedance and vs is the source voltage so obviously current i is equals to vs upon zs plus zl where vs is the total voltage so i is equals to total voltage upon total impedance where zs can be written uh, as rs plus jxs and zl also can be written as rl plus jxl the power transfer from source to load will be pl that can be written as i square rl power transfer from source source to load pl is equals to i square rl so pl is equals to vs square upon zs plus zl ka whole square rl on solving this equation we get the value of pl as we all know that for maxima or minima the differentiation of the thing should be zero that's why for maximum power transfer dpl by dxl should be zero for solving this equation we get that xs is equals to minus xl on putting these values in equation number 1 we get that pl is equals to vs square rl upon rs plus rl again for maximum power transfer theorem theorem the differentiation of pl with uh, respect to rl should be zero that's why rs is equals to rl so from equation 2 and 3 we get that xs is equals to minus xl and rs is equals to rl in combined form we can write it zs is equals to rs plus jxl xs and also is equals to rl minus jxl so here it has been proved that for maximum power transfer the load impedance should be complex conjugate to the source impedance thank you